Hey there, Jason here from Unity3D.College. Recently I've been working a lot in beta versions of Unity and they're really stable, but with any beta you should expect crashes on occasion. Sometimes things just don't work out, something blows up, you use a new feature and there's an issue. And if you haven't saved your scene, you've been working for a while and Unity crashes, it can really suck. You can lose a lot of work. For instance, if I went around, you know, working on this level, moving some buildings and resizing things, all this kind of fun stuff and say I'd spent a good half hour to an hour and I wasn't in the habit of constantly hitting control S to save and then I hit play and something bad happens. Well let's simulate that right now. I have this little script here that'll just crash the editor whenever I hit play if it's on something so I'll just drop it onto any old game object, hit play and watch it explode. There we go. So now we've got an error Unity's crashed and I didn't save so I've lost my changes. If this happens to you, don't worry, you can recover it, but you need to make sure you don't relaunch Unity. Instead, you need to find the folder where your project is, here's mine, and then go into the temp folder and then you'll see an underscore underscore backup scenes folder. This is where Unity is putting your scene before you start playing so that your changes aren't saved. Essentially it saves this off, you make any changes while you're playing, that's fine, it's gonna restore back from this backup file. But we can pull this in, as long as we don't restart Unity. Again, if you restart it, this is gonna get cleared out, you'll lose the file. So what we can do is just copy this file, just hit Control C, go back into the Assets folder, I'm just gonna go into my Scenes folder, and paste it in. Then we just rename it to a .unity file instead of .backup. If you can't see the extensions, by the way, there's an option in Windows. You can get to that under the View menu. Go to View, and then uh, Options, then this View tab here, and just make sure that Hide Extensions for Known File Types is off. Otherwise, you might not be able to rename the file extension there. Now I can just reopen Unity. Again, you need to make sure that we copied and renamed this file first, or at least copied it, because it's gonna get deleted as soon as I relaunch and reopen the project. But watch, as I pull this back up, there we go. We should see our scene totally available with all of the changes that I made right before it crashed. There we go, I've got my zero scene. Again, I could just rename that old town one and replace it, but I'm just gonna open them side by side. And let's go take a look, go down here, and look, my water tower is still small, the building's still out of the way, even though this original town one is broken and messed up, missing my changes. So that's all you need, you really just have to, again, don't relaunch the editor, don't reopen your project until you copy that file. Once you copy that file out, you're good to go. You can recover your changes, no problems. All right, if this was helpful for you, please don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and all that stuff. And if you have some other tips like this, uh, different things that you think other people would really benefit from, please just drop a comment below. And if I can do a video about them, I will. I'd love to you know, share more good ideas. And if you have questions also, just drop them below. I try to answer as many as I can. All right, thanks again. Have a great day.